So, Grand Theft Auto Online's summer DLC may be back on the old release schedule. We've got some GTA 6 news and a few other bits and bobs. Hi and welcome back, my name's Dan and I'm an old grumpy gamer. So let's turn the clock back a bit. You know our beloved GTA Online has a bit of a tradition, a sweet spot for a mid-year update. And yeah, like clockwork, every year around summertime we get a solid helping of fresh-ish content to sink our teeth into. Now this year's been a little hush-hush, a bit on the down low even. Normally by now we'd have our detectives on the internet uncovering leaks, discovering rumours and piecing together the puzzle that is the upcoming DLC. But this time around, it's as quiet as a stealth mission in the dead of night. What we do have though is a tidbit from Rockstar themselves. They've been chattering about some future adjustments. But here's the twist folks, they're talking about tweaks and tunings, not a grand explosion of new stuff. So we might be looking for a smaller DLC focusing on more finessing the existing game mechanics. So when is this much anticipated summer DLC dropping? Well, sharpen your pencils and mark your calendar because the rumor mill is spinning out of date, June 12th or June 13th. A little while back, our good friends over at Rockstar had a bit of a blip in their newswire. A certain GTA Plus month's end date was originally set up as June 12th, a Monday. But then, in a twist, as dramatic as a Los Santos car chase, they switched it to June 7th. This switcheroo has sparked more speculation than a mystery in Mount Chilead. Why you ask? Well, because dear viewers, Tuesdays are when DLC magic happens. Yes, a new GTA Plus month beginning on a Tuesday is like Rockstar leaving us a trail of breadcrumbs leading to a brand spanking new DLC. DLC. And to add fuel to this flaming rumour, let's stroll down memory lane. It seems that June has a special place in Rockstar's heart as they have historically given us updates during this sunny month. So are we in for another June surprise? Well, we'll just have to wait and see. So what is this DLC likely to be about? You've heard rumours and we're here to break them down. Rockstar has been hinting at some planned adjustments for our upcoming summer DLC with a focus around rebalancing. And yes, you guessed it. It's all about those high-flying or inspiring, sometimes infuriating aerial vehicles, which is no surprise given we've had a few plain, heavy, focused weeks over the last few months. And Ron did make a reappearance in the LS Drug Wars DLC. Now, we can only speculate how these changes might ripple through our beloved GTA Online universe, but we can be sure of one thing. Rockstar seems to be listening, and they're rolling up their sleeves to make our criminal enterprises just a tad bit smoother. From gameplay to player experience, everything seems to be under a magnifying glass. So, are we in for a grander Grand Theft Auto experience? Eh, only time will tell. I mean, stay tuned and we'll keep our eyes on the horizon and look out for any more clues from the enigmatic Rockstar themselves. Next up, let's turn our eyes towards our friends still rocking those older consoles, the PS4 and the Xbox One. Rumour has it they may have some choppy waters ahead. Remember when Rockstar mentioned those service updates in the newswire? Yeah, that's got some people breaking out in a bit of a cold sweat. Why do you ask? Well, think about it. The old but gold PS4 and Xbox One have seen some action in their time. But with the new PS5 and Xbox Series X charging full steam ahead, there's a looming concern that Rockstar might just pull the plug on the updates for the older consoles. And before you start throwing tomatoes at me, remember this is all speculation at this point. But there's also the harsh reality we might have to face. When tech moves forward, eventually it leaves the old tech and, well, old, like me, unsupported. Now, if this turns out to be true, what does it mean for our GTA diehards on the older systems? Unfortunately, it could mean missing out on the summer sun fun of the DLC, and perhaps future ones too, so ouch. But hey, no need to get gloomy just yet, Rockstar hasn't given any official word, so let's keep those controllers close and hope for the best. All right, buckle up because it is time to address the elephant in the room. No, no, it's not that I stole your car in Los Santos, it's something much bigger. We're diving into the swirling whirlpool of speculation that is Grand Theft Auto 6. Yes indeed, rumour has it some of the wizards behind the Grand Theft Auto Online have been magically transported to the mythical land of GTA 6 development. Now if that's true, it could signal a monumental shift for our beloved Online Mayhem Fest. If the Rockstar game devs have been kicked over to polishing the world of GTA 6, it might mean that future updates to GTA Online could be, let's say, eh, a tad leaner than we're used to. Who knows? We might see more quality of 
life improvements and fewer exploding cars. But okay, let's not hope for fewer explosions. We love the chaos. And speaking of GTA 6, this developer shift could be a sign, a beacon, if you will, pointing us towards an earlier than expected release timeline. So still nothing official, official from Rockstar. They like to keep us guessing and they love to play things close to the chest. So stay tuned, stay excited and keep your fingers crossed for more high speed chases and sky high explosions in the world of GTA. So what do you think? Are we on the money with a June release or are we drifting in the wrong lane? Do you reckon these changes will spice up your GTA Online experience or drop a banana peel in your way? Don't be a silent passenger. Chime in in the comments section below. We're all ears for your insights and predictions or your wildest GTA conspiracy theories. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Wash your hands. We'll see you in the next video.